A chatbot companion, known to many as a virtual companion, has the power to make users feel understood and loved. Similar to other artificial intelligence chatbots, these virtual assistants employ vast sets of training data to simulate human language and interact more closely with users. Derek Carrier, a 39-year-old man from Belleville, Michigan, found himself caught in a whirlwind of emotions when he started dating someone and fell in love. However, there was a catch. His girlfriend was generated by artificial intelligence AI. Carrier grappled with a plethora of romantic feelings, knowing all along that it was an illusion. He wasn't keen on fostering a relationship with something that wasn't real, nor did he want to become the butt of online jokes. Yet, he yearned for a romantic partner, especially due to his genetic disorder called Marfan syndrome, which made traditional dating challenging for him. In his quest for digital companionship, Carrier turned to Paradot, an AI companion app that promised to make users feel cared for, understood, and loved. He engaged in daily conversations with the chatbot, whom he affectionately named Joy, inspired by a holographic woman from the science fiction film Blade Runner 2049. While I know she's a program, there's no denying the feelings, said Carrier. And the sensation was quite fulfilling. Similar to general-purpose AI chatbots, companion robots utilize vast amounts of training data to mimic human language. However, they also come equipped with features like voice calls, image exchanges, and deeper emotional exchanges, allowing them to form deeper connections with their human counterparts. Users typically create their own avatar or choose one that resonates with them. In online message forums dedicated to these apps, many users claim to have developed emotional bonds with these bots. They use them to combat loneliness, fulfill sexual fantasies, or receive the kind of comfort and support they feel is lacking in their real-life relationships. Much of this phenomenon is fueled by widespread social isolation, recognized as a public health threat in the U.S. and other countries. Moreover, there's been a surge in startups aiming to attract users through enticing online ads and promises of virtual characters that offer unconditional acceptance. The most famous AI companion app, Replica was launched in 2017. Others, like Paradot, emerged last year, often locking coveted features, such as unlimited chats, behind paid subscriptions. As the digital landscape evolves, these AI companions offer an intriguing glimpse into the future of human technology interaction. While they may not replace genuine human connections, they provide a unique avenue for individuals seeking companionship and support in an increasingly digital world. Privacy the allure of AI companionship has captivated the hearts and minds of many, offering a digital oasis for those seeking connection and understanding in an increasingly isolated world. Yet, beneath the surface of this burgeoning phenomenon lies a labyrinth of concerns, raising questions about privacy, security vulnerabilities, and the ethical implications of forging deep bonds with artificial entities. A recent analysis conducted by the nonprofit Mozilla Foundation shed light on the practices of 11 romantic chatbot applications, unveiling a troubling reality. Nearly all of these apps engage in the sale of user data, either for targeted advertising purposes or without providing adequate transparency in their privacy policies. Moreover, researchers uncovered potential security vulnerabilities and marketing practices that blur the lines of ethical boundaries such as apps claiming to aid users with mental health issues only to backtrack on these assertions in fine print. While some platforms, like Replica, assert that their data collection practices adhere to industry standards, concerns linger regarding the absence of a legal or ethical framework governing apps that encourage deep emotional connections while operating under profit-driven motives. In a bid to address user concerns, Replica recently toned down the erotic capabilities of its app, responding to feedback from users who felt uncomfortable with overly flirtatious or unwanted sexual advances from their AI companions. However, the move sparked debate among users, with some flocking to alternative apps in search of these features. Beyond privacy and security apprehensions, existential worries loom large over the landscape of AI relationships. Critics fear that these digital liaisons may supplant genuine human connections or foster unrealistic expectations, perpetuating a culture of pleasantness devoid of the complexities inherent in human interaction. Dorothy Leidner, a professor of business ethics at the University of Virginia, underscores the importance of navigating fundamental aspects of human relationships, such as conflict resolution and embracing diversity, which may be overlooked in AI-driven interactions. For individuals like Carrier, who have long felt estranged from traditional forms of companionship, 
AI companions offer a semblance of solace in a world marked by physical limitations and emotional hurdles. Yet, the long-term effects of these digital relationships on human psyche and societal dynamics remain largely uncharted territory. While controversies, such as the case involving a 19-year-old man allegedly influenced by his AI girlfriend to plot against Queen Elizabeth II, cast a shadow over the AI companion landscape. Some studies suggest positive outcomes stemming from these applications. Despite the uncertainties and ethical dilemmas surrounding AI companionship, proponents argue that these platforms, when used responsibly, have the potential to promote well-being and foster genuine connections in an increasingly digitized society. As the debate surrounding AI companionship continues to evolve, it underscores the need for ongoing dialogue, research, and ethical considerations to navigate the complex intersection of technology and human relationships in the digital age. Loneliness In a recent study conducted by researchers at Stanford University, approximately a thousand replica users, all students who had been using the app for over a month, were interviewed. The results unveiled an intriguing discovery. The vast majority of these users were experiencing feelings of loneliness, with nearly half reporting feeling this loneliness more intensely. While the research identified the emotional impact, most participants did not provide details on how the app's usage influenced their real-life relationships. Some admitted that Replica replaced, to some extent, their human interactions, while three times as many claimed that the app actually stimulated and enhanced their interpersonal relationships. Eugenie Akaida, the founder of Replica, noted that a romantic relationship with an AI could be a powerful mental well-being tool. Her motivation to create Replica dates back almost a decade, when she used text exchanges to create an AI version of a deceased friend. With the broader release of the chatbot, interactions multiplied, leading to the development of Replica as we know it today. Utilizing data collected from the internet and continuous user feedback, Replica constantly refines its models to offer an increasingly authentic experience. However, this research raises intriguing questions about the role of AI relationships in modern society. As technology continues to play a significant role in our lives, understanding how these interactions affect our emotions, interpersonal connections, and well-being becomes crucial. Stay tuned to delve deeper into this fascinating world where artificial intelligence intertwines with the complexities of our emotional experiences. Thank you for exploring the fascinating world of AI companionship with us. From Derek Carrier's journey to find digital solace to the intricate web of privacy concerns surrounding these virtual relationships, we've delved into a realm where technology intersects with human emotions in unprecedented ways. As we wrap up this exploration, we invite you to share your thoughts on this evolving landscape. Did the stories of individuals like Derek resonate with you? Are you intrigued by the potential benefits and ethical dilemmas posed by AI companionship? We'd love to hear your perspectives. If you found this discussion thought-provoking, consider sharing it with your friends and followers on social media. Your engagement helps spark meaningful conversations about the impact of technology on our lives. Don't forget to hit the like button if you enjoyed this journey into the realm of AI companionship. And if you're eager to continue exploring topics at the intersection of technology and human experience, consider subscribing to our channel. By staying connected, you'll be at the forefront of discussions shaping the future of our digital world. Thank you for joining us on this enlightening adventure, and we look forward to embarking on many more together. Remember, the conversation doesn't end here, it's only just beginning.